Today we're playing Kronos by Makers MELX. The title screen's pretty. I like the sci fi buildings and the, uh, what's it called? Uh, Dutch Angle. I like the music too. Alright, let's get started. Kronos, a device that is capable of converting kinetic energy into... Oh, I missed it. Kinetic conversion field. Not all is lost in time. I fell asleep at work again. That's strange. Everyone should have gone home already. I hear people talking in the office. The deal is done. The AIM transport team will arrive before the lab opens tomorrow to pick up the Kronos. We can't hand over the device in its current state. Kronos is unstable. When the store of divinium is depleted, it could cause an explosion. Fine. I must protect Kronos. Divinium's at max capacity. I should have enough to, time to reach the backup stabilization bay a few miles away. Very cool movie. Escape before the time bar is depleted. Waz to move. Mouse to move the camera. This is pretty. Oh, I like the fog effect on the city. There's even shadows casting on the fog. That's cool. It looks like I am a pill. Uh, so I guess I'm gonna have a time limit, which is that blue bar. What is that yellow bar? I'm gonna experiment a little here. Shift, space bar. Jump at the ledge to climb. Okay, so it's like doom. Do that one. Which way do I go? I wonder if I could pick that. Well, I'm not gonna try it. It feels a little odd the fact that. The pull-up animation occurs when you're falling down, just after the peak of the jump. It seems like, I'm not like a parkour person or anything, but, um, or where the turret will shoot you. It seems like the, the pull-up would be on the going up motion. Whoa, I'm surprised I did not get hit. That was fun. Right mouse button for shield. Okay, is it shielded all over or just the front? Dang. Bullets are converted to time by using the shield. Is that a good thing? That is a good thing. Oh, oh, okay, getting hit actually takes time away from you. Interesting. I thought I had a checkpoint. The movement and everything feels really good. Um, like, I feel like I have good, decent air control, maybe even a little too much air control. But it is kind of a parkour game, so I'm not going to complain. Uh, 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 
<laughs> I wonder if I can cheat and do some shortcuts here. Like, can I reach that? Ah, shoot. Yeah, you can cheat a little bit, it looks like. Okay, I need some time back. Why is that? Hmm. I feel like I was blocking them. I don't know why I was getting hit. Shoot. Ah, oh, dang it. Is this the end? It is the end. Try next level in dev. Oh, okay, it's not done yet. Level 2. What's up with that building? It looks like a Lego tower. <laughs> oh, I see why it's in dev. That's okay. Hmm. Can I stand in between? Yeah. This is cool. I don't know how this would work in like a city setting. Oh shoot. Dang it. You gotta hold down the jump button to pull yourself up. I keep forgetting that. Oh look, I can do little little bunny hops. I like that. Huh, I wonder how, how come I can't pull myself up onto that. I did hold the space bar down that time. Shoot. Oh. Bunny hop my way to victory. Okay. I'm gonna run and hold it down. Holding it! And, okay, we did it that time. This obstacle is getting just a little bit repetitive. Oh shoot. What am I doing wrong? What in the world? Okay, I have to let go of forward. Maybe that's my problem. Yeah, yeah, that seems to be the issue. That's a little weird. You think you would be able to hold on to forward and pull yourself up. It's like a maze. Uh, which way? I don't know if this is where I'm supposed to be going. Yeah, I'm going the wrong way, aren't I? <laughs> well. fall damage. Oh, there's not. The uh, sound effects of my character pulling himself up and jumping and stuff gets a little repetitive. Oh, shoot. Um, one thing you could do is you could pitch shift the sound slightly to make them sound a little bit different. Oh, I'm supposed to come from this way. I got you. What in the world? Where am I supposed to go? Ooh. Well... Uh. Okay, 
so I think... Oh, I don't know where I am. I thought I saw the, uh... The goal. I'm gonna set myself back a little bit, but that's okay. Yeah, it's over there. At least that's what it looks like. So I gotta get over there somehow. One thing that might be nice is if you could somehow show the goal. Um, at the beginning of the stage, it would give me a better idea of where I'm supposed to be heading to in a general direction. But I'm not sure how to get past this right here, and it might just be because it's uh, still in development, so that's okay. I guess I'll go ahead and give my final thoughts. Overall, I like it. It, it has very good movement and everything. Um, I, I like the, the rooftop sort of theme, and the idea of like it being a race. Um, the immediate comparison is a game like uh, Mirror's Edge, or maybe Dishonored. But one of my main complaints with, with Mirror's Edge was there wasn't really like a, a reason to do all the parkour. But because I'm on a, I'm on the clock with this one, it actually gives me a reason to find an efficient path and sort of move through the city. So I like that. Couple of complaints about some tweaks with the movement, but uh, overall it feels pretty good. Um, might work on the level design just a little bit. I mentioned like the idea of showing the player like this is your end goal. Maybe start me out from a high place and sort of point me at it so I can see where I'm supposed to be going. Um, I don't know, the, the only other thing I might think of is... Uh, some, pl do, some players have a hard time with the idea of... Um, platforming in first person. They have a hard time of knowing like where their feet are and things like that. Um, I know there are tricks to help with that. Things like actually being able to look down and see your body can help a lot. Um, I don't know a whole lot about it, but you might want to look into that. I'm not one of those people that has a problem. I can just kind of... I generally have an idea of like where my body is, even in a virtual space. But I know there are people that have a really hard time with that. So that might be something you want to look into. But overall, I think it's a great job. And it's fun. Um, I definitely would play more if there were more to play. But yeah, I enjoy what's here, and I hope you guys, or gals, do good. Because I know you're, it's a school project or something, so good luck with it. I had fun.